I mean, we might hopefully have a couple of good practices. Uh, uh, you know, hopefully our bodies will be somewhat rested. And, and uh, the biggest thing is, is to, in my mind, is to, that, that they, they've done a good thing, but they can't negate the good thing by thinking about the good thing. they got, they got to be moving forward and think next play and, and certainly respect the next play because we're obviously playing a team that can beat you. Considering he was totally out, <laughs> Couldn't even ride a bike for three weeks. Uh, uh, bad condition. Didn't really bounce the ball, and, and then uh, comes back and he's got 20 assists and one turnover in the league. So, uh, you know, he, he's, he just gives us a, a, another ball handler and somebody that late game situation like the other day can just, you know, take care of the ball, utilize the clock, and get the ball where it needs to go. Um, but he, he's he's a good player, and, and uh, certainly I, I can see him continue to play more. Nobody can be in that good a mood all the time. <laughs> uh, but he, he's a, he is a great teammate, and he's a happy-go-lucky kid. And, and you know, I, I would be curious to, to poll kids on our campus because our players swear that he's the most popular kid on, on, on campus just about. And, and uh, I don't know if that's accurate or not, but certainly in our players' minds it certainly is. We, we've had some great – Wayne made a play at OE last year that yeah. was unbelievable. Yeah. Uh, uh, but it was a, a, a quick burst, two or three second play. Uh, Wayne dove out of bounds one time and kicked one of the Brandmeyers in the face last year uh, on the press row. And we've had other guys do that. We had a play at Baylor that was like three or four offensive rebounds and guys getting knocked down and getting up and getting being part of the play. But this was an individual play. I mean, this was a, a 17, 18, 20 second play uh, that was just total hustle by an individual's on an individual's uh, behalf. And I, I don't think that, you know, everybody say Mario's shot. Mario's shot was a great shot. This was the best play. I mean, because uh, when you think about plays, you think about hustle, you think about athleticism. You know, he, I mean, gets his shot blocked and the block he had on the other end and then getting up and getting both feet in bounds before he gets the ball and then running down and falling into the first row of the band, uh, uh, going for the rebound and then coming back at half court. I mean, I've never seen a, a better dive for a ball not only did he dive for it, he dove for it and stole it as he dove. I mean, it was a remarkable play. Uh, and then Frank finishing with the end one. So uh, uh, it, it, that got me excited. And I think plays, that, that's what we talk about all the time is, is you know, winning loose ball possessions and, and, and toughness type things. And I think that gave us some confidence. So, uh, but, but, you know, Jamari, uh, for the most part, you're exactly right. Body language can be a big positive, but it can also be a negative. When he's not doing well, his shoulder stoops and things like that, and we got to work through that. It's better than it used to be, but still, we got some improvement to do in that. But, but, uh, but on that deal, there was he was just out there running and balling. You know, they love lose at five at K State, if I'm not mistaken. Should have beat at West Virginia. Uh, uh, I'm trying to think of the other games off the top of my head. Texas ended up getting them pretty good. Uh, they went by 20 at Lubbock, and we saw what happened at Lubbock with with, uh, with Iowa State. Uh, the TCU game was a, a close game uh, uh, with West Virginia the first time they played. I mean, they've been in the games right there, and they've had they've had some bad luck. And certainly, Trent's done a good job, obviously, and they're much improved. And they still Anderson still keys everything for them, but, but we're going to have to play a good basketball game. Uh, Trent's Trent's been uh, coach of the year, I think, in all three conferences that he's coached in. I mean, guy can coach and learn from. Mike Montgomery and, and uh, one of my old assistants is one of his assistants down there, and and, and uh, I know they do a good job. Of, uh, so so no surprise at all that they got the better. They make you they don't beat themselves. I think it's amazing to me when you, their field their field goal percentage defense is terrific. Uh, but the big thing is you have to make plays to score against them. They don't give you easy points. And 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 on the flip side of that, they're averaging about thirty free throw attempts a game. So they get to the line probably better than any team in our league with maybe the exception of West Virginia.